It's no surprise that volatility has picked up and this has become a news-driven market. More than ever, I think it pays to be nimble, enter at the exact right moment, because when you have that risk-reward ratio, there's some high volatility opportunities that you can capitalize on. In today's video, I want to show you how to take advantage of those opportunities using some automated trading scripts. Now, I've talked a lot about these automated trading scripts before. I've made tons of videos. In today's video, I want to show you some examples of these scripts and how to use them successfully. Now, most recently, we had an automated trading script get us into our first 20 shares inside of Huntsman. This was a swing trading setup in which we got into that position on this red candle right here. That position is currently working and we have two more automated entry scripts currently working there. Today, I had another automated entry script, but this time more from a day trading perspective, looking to short five shares of XLV, a very small entry position here. Now this was purely to test out some new scripts, but what I want to demonstrate is the potential with options inside of SPY for this exact same script. Now let's take a look at XLV here first. XLV, this particular script that I'm talking about is this one right here. It's the one in which we take our one, two punch setup and we translate that into a full blown strategy that has both bearish and bullish entry pieces. You can watch the full video here and code it yourself. And for all volatility box members, I have the code updated slightly and you can copy that code, which I think is more performant for live market hours and directly use it into your thinkorswim platform. I have other videos which show you how to do it, but that same process is what I use today inside of XLV here. And you'll notice the entry came in the candle after we had this pink arrow, which is when the conditions were met. So this red arrow is in which we have all of the conditions met. The next candle, we're looking for the entry. The entry got filled 149.80. That was at 1240 PM Pacific and the exit 1250 PM Pacific, less than 10 minutes later for very little heat on this trade. Now, this is a very low risk idea, but this is meant to test and work through all of the different kinks that Thinkorswim might have so that we can take advantage of setups like this one inside of SPY. Now, SPY becomes very interesting because SPY, you have the same exact triggers. However, with SPY, you have options that are much more liquid, which you can still connect these automated scripts to. Let me show you how you would do that. For example, yesterday here, we had the same sort of signal trigger near 7.44 p.m. after the S&P had breached the aggressive and the conservative daily volatility box models. So ever since this red candle, you can place this automated trading script and Thinkorswim will wait and watch all of this time and enter when we actually have this blue arrow. I think that's quite powerful where you can essentially turn Thinkorswim into your own personal trading assistant. This is even better, in my opinion, than a lot of APIs, things of that nature, because I can still visually see this working on my charts. Now, the script becomes useful when, say, you see that trigger, or even before you see that trigger, you know you're looking to buy, so I can use the bull code, come inside of Thinkorswim, choose whatever strike and expiration that is. So let's say it was the 585 call, hypothetically. I could use that call. The same way we would connect the automated trading scripts underneath conditions, I can click symbol, which auto fills to the underlying. This is spy, but notice this time I'm buying the actual call, not the underlying. I can connect this to my script here so I can click edit, navigate to think script editor and paste in all of that code. I just copied say enter whenever this condition is true. Choose whatever time frame I'd like, click OK. You can also link this to, in this case, since we're buying the bid price and try and get a little bit greedier. Maybe you want a price that's, say, 20 bucks better than whatever the market's currently at. And you can choose how many of these you'd like. If this is your first time with these scripts, always, always, always test in paper money. You can also add in your exit orders here with an OCO bracket if you wanted to make this trade fully hands off. Now, if I click confirm and send, Thinkorswim is automatically now waiting and watching for the next time on this two minute chart, we see the same momentum cross. 
and it's going to enter, or rather try and place the order to enter at, we said, 20 uh, bucks better than whatever the market might be, and see if it can get a fill at that particular strike, and use that to get you into this particular option position. This allows you to use leverage to also trade with these automated trading scripts, and you can combine that for some swing trading setups as well. I hope you found this video helpful in understanding how you can turn automated trading scripts into your personal workforce, your personal set of trading assistants that's always working inside of Thinkorswim and looking for the very best setups. For all Volatility Box members on our website, you can find all of the videos that I have along with six examples so that you have six starting points that you can use to pick and choose from and use that as a baseline to build your own set of automated trading scripts. I hope you found this video helpful. Take care, everyone. Good luck trading, and I'll see you in our next update.